Hello, ladies, gentlemen, and fellow NGTers. I see what I did there. I put the URS on NGT. Not very clever, I know, but I'll take credit for it. <laughs> What's up, guys? Neely here. And uh, today, Medal of Honor gameplay. And uh, this is the map Kunar base, and the game mode is obviously Team Assault. And I have my Dr. Pepper here next to me. 23 flavors of goodness that I absolutely love. And I'm ready to go, and hopefully you guys are as well. Going to go 15-6 in this gameplay, and I think you guys should enjoy this. This is... Uh, me just sort of rushing around like a crazy fool, just trying to kill as many people in sight. Uh, the one thing I will tell you about this gameplay is it has to be two, three months after the game's release, so we're probably talking December, January gameplay footage here. Uh, I say that because I can tell by the scoreboard at the end of this game that the uh, the score cap was 1,400, the original Team Assault cap was 1,200, and they patched it in where they added about, uh, what, 20-some more kills or whatever it was. So they increased the level cap a little bit and whatnot. And uh, so this gameplay, a little bit old, not exactly current, but it's a uh, good gameplay, and I'm surprised I haven't showcased this gameplay yet, either here on NGT Games or on my channel. Uh, with that being said, today I'm going to analyze some of the gameplay as needed, and uh, I'm going to talk about some things that are going on with me, and uh, I'll sort of tie it in with some, uh, some statuses, or, or better yet, how I could say this is the multiplayer status of today's games. <clears throat> Excuse me there. And, uh, it, you know, it's funny how, how things can change in a few days. And I'm going to get to that in a minute. But uh, some of the things I'm going to cover. First, I'm going to talk real briefly about the Killzone 3 beta. And uh, by now, you guys probably saw my first thoughts, my first thoughts video that I released to you guys. And um, so, yeah, I'm going to talk about that. And then we'll probably go into Medal of Honor itself. And then, um, like I said, I'll probably go into the status of today's online games. So first off, I will tell you, I am not very happy with Killzone 3 at all. And I was surprised to hear that uh, a long time... Excuse me, I got a burp coming. There we go, stopped it. <laughs> Hooray for me. Anyways, back on topic. Um, I was surprised to find that a lot of people that I know are not enjoying Killzone 3 Beta. Um, and even a, a friend of mine who's been a long time fan of the series, Love Killzone 2, he is just up in arms, absolutely hates the game. And I'm sort of in the same boat. I'm pretty sure I'm going to be canceling my pre-order pre of that game. The gameplay is just, just bad. Um... You know, I talked in that last video uh, of my first thoughts how, you know, the foundation is there with the squad support and the clan support, but the gameplay, it's got issues, and unless they do some serious reworking, which I don't see how they're going to do in a matter of less than a month, I'm just, I'm not interested. It's, the gameplay is not very solid, there's, there's too much crunched into one game, there's too many retarded, uh, you know, tactical powers that just don't make any sense why they're in the game. And even the guns, the gameplay, the way the gun shoots just is not good. Uh, and of course, as I say this, some of you may like Killzone 3, the beta that is. And you know, that's your opinion. But I just want to let you guys know that I'm not very happy with Killzone 3. And I'm not necessarily sure that I'm even going to pick that game up at this point. And that's kind of a disappointment because I really want to do the SOCOM 4 beta. Obviously, if you get uh, Killzone 3, if you buy it. Um, or if you have it pre-ordered and buy it, uh, you get the SOCOM 4 beta, and I'm a big SOCOM guy, so I'm going to be bummed out, but, so I'm kind of in a dilemma of, of what I want to do. But I just wanted to state that out of the gate, sort of a little follow-up to my first thoughts video, and uh, I want to relate that to sort of what my, my commentary is, my, my whole agenda behind what, I, what I'm talking about here. Uh, in terms of Medal of Honor itself, guys, I still really like Medal of Honor, and it's kind of hard for, for me to find people to play with, because even some of the, even some of my friends that, you know, that I used to play this game with when it first came out and when I was really enjoying this game, just don't seem to really buy into this game much, and I'm trying to figure out why that is. Um, maybe it's, maybe it's boringness, maybe since there's not a lot of maps, although they did release Hot Zone DLC, which incorporated new maps, and then they, you know, they, um release downloadable clean sweep DLC if any of you guys are not familiar with what I'm talking about just search it on Google or whatever uh, clean sweep and hot zone were two game modes that were added to this game probably around Christmas time that you could have bought for DLC and so you know I got clean sweep that was free and but I didn't buy hot zone and maybe I need to get on that maybe that's why I feel that Medal of Honor has kinda lost its touch and it's not necessary that I'm bored of it but I really have no one to really play with and I'm sure as soon as I'm saying this people are like oh Neil I'll play with that you know you'll probably type in a way in the comment section but uh, as far as Medal of Honor itself I, I think I'm gonna be trying to get more gameplay footage of this game because this footage here shows an example of sort of my gameplay in my prime you know when I was really good at this game and I, I still really enjoy it I just can't seem to find people that enjoy it as much as me and um like I said, I don't know if it's the boringness behind this game, but I definitely still want to get some more captured footage of this. 
Um, so let me know what you think about that. But my point here, and specifically what I said about boringness, is the games that are developed these days, guys, what, what are your opinions on stuff like Black Ops, Killzone 3, Medal of Honor, um, and I can't think of any other games, but is the gameplay these days, is it not as good as it what it used to be, or are these game developers just trying to put too much in, into multiplayer gaming? I, I just find myself really ping-ponging on online games this past year, and I can't really settle into one game. And I don't know if it's just I don't like the gameplay of certain games. There are certain games that I'm good at, and of course that I want to play. Medal of Honor is one of them. Mag is one of them that I'm, I'm pretty good at. Black Ops I'm good at, but I just there's there's issues with Black Ops which just piss me off the way the game plays at times. Like I said, I have issues with the kills in three beta, and uh, I, I just have issues with certain games and the way they play these days. And it's my opinion, you know, of of how this all unravels, but. Is it is it is it just me? I, I mean, this is a really bold statement to make. Is it just me? Is it me getting bored, or is it just the status of these gameplays, uh, the way games handle these days? Are they just are they not good? I I don't know what it is because I found myself in the past year really ping ponging off a lot of games. Uh, with that being said, I I think the two games that I really want to concentrate on on for you guys here in the next couple months before SOCOM 4 comes out is Medal of Honor and Mag. I want Mag to make a return on my channel, and I want to try to highlight it again here on uh, NGT Games. And I just have a fascination with Zipper. I, I think they're one of the very few companies, along with Dice, who makes Battlefield Bad Company 2, who are pretty much the only ones that know what they're doing I think these days and know how to make a multiplayer game balanced and fun and competitive at the same time again just my opinion I'd like to hear your opinions uh, in terms of the big hitters like a black ops or a kill zone or something like that is is it just that is the gameplay not solid is it boring to you guys what what's the deal here why why do you think I've been ping-ponging off these games for the past couple years um, obviously I have my heavy favorites uh, two of the games that are made by DICE, Medal of Honor and Battlefield Bad Company 2, and Vietnam included. I really still enjoy those games. I really do. I think they're two of the best games on the market. And then obviously you have the games that are made by Zipper, uh, Mag, and then SOCOM 4, which is coming out. So in terms of, of what I like, I, I definitely am a person that likes Zipper and DICE. And I just feel like I, I can't go back to playing Treyarch or Infinity Ward or even Guerrilla Games, I just I, I feel like there's there's something there that's just not leading me into those games, and I, I can't figure it out and why well, I'm ping ponging off those games. But uh, so yeah, that's sort of my my little rant there. Um, again, I touched base on the kills in three beta, why I have issues with it in terms of the gameplay. I talked about Medal of Honor itself. I still really like this game and want to bring footage. I have a couple more videos that I can post here, and I'm going to try to get more footage for you guys. And then in terms of of developers and you know in their games. Um, is the gameplay these days just getting stale, or is it just me just ping-ponging way too much and getting bored way too fast? And um, I, I don't know what it is. I, I, like I said, I'd like to hear your, your comments about that. Again, I tried to tie in gameplay with the community itself and, and how uh, gameplay is and, and the status of the gameplay uh, in, in terms of online uh, games. If that makes sense. Um, so yeah, that's about all I have. 50 and 6 is the final score. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. For more Medal of Honor coverage or any other gameplay, visit my channel. Link is in the description below in this video. Plenty more footage coming as always. And uh, this has been Neely from NGT Games. You guys have a good one. Take care. Hey guys, we're on Facebook. Check the description of this video for the link to our new Facebook application. Subscribe and get our latest video updates posted right on the wall on your own Facebook page.